Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Jackass the Game. Last episode, we did episode 5, and it's time to move on to episode 6. Well now, Reverend Jones, just who is the cutest jackass boy this season? Now, I only seen half of them so far, but the half I have seen sure is so hot damn tasty. I used to be real sweet on Chris, but he shed a few LBs. Knoxville may be the best looking, but he's not the cutest. Right, now he's the cute boy. This new series is 100% finger licking. Ooh -wee. What radio station is playing right now is what I want to know. You have unlocked Dimitri. I hate it when I Dimitri is the guy that would uh, play in the fat suits and stuff. If I'm not mistaken, that's pretty cool that you can be him. So, yeah. Definitely check out the description if you want to see the previous episodes that you guys missed. And we're going to start off with Roof Race. I like me some Roof Race. It kind of reminds me of the Pogo one. But now we're in the bumper cars again. I'm starting to see a pattern. There's almost like one of these race ones in each episode. Race stunts, I guess is the proper term. Which I'm down with. All of them have been uh, really fun. Let me know what you guys have thought about the game so far. We're almost finished all the stunts. And then we'll move on to challenge mode and look at some extras. Well, we're definitely going to have to hit that target, I'm assuming. Hi, I'm Ryan Dunn, and with me is a dipshit I don't like. And this is Roof Race. <laughs> Win the race, smash through a billboard, destroy 12 objects, bail out into a water tower, make a 30 yard jump. Okay, smash through a billboard, you say? Bail into a water tower. What the? What kind of technology are we using right now? Alright, what kind of objects? Is that an object? Let's do some objects while we test out the controls and stuff like that. Wonder if I could have destroyed those little small air ducts. Oh, hit the jump. Whew, barely made that. Yeah, those things do count, so. Definitely hit them. This one is pretty hard because the, the bumper car's controls are just the worst. You turn very slow and then really fast right away, so. Whoops. You can boost? Oh yeah. Oh my god. Oh, that's that electricity. Okay. That's probably how you go 30 yards, I'm assuming. Alright, I'm in third. Whew. Wonder how far away the finish line is. Let's go. Use that boost. Oh my god. Did not see that one coming. Oh, he boosted himself across the jump. Wow. Fly into a billboard. Damn it. <laughs> okay. We'll find a nice billboard to aim ourselves at. Go. Some of these games just remind me of like Mario Party style, but obviously rated R <laughs> and way out of the box. Just imagine if there was like a Marty Mario Party game where you can just like do these kind of stunts against each other. You have to like, you know, move across the board, earn money, and whatnot. I don't know. This this game is just giving me game ideas more than anything. Like some of these races, if you played against each other in like an online setting or Oh, he went through the billboard. That. Ooh, thanks for the boost. Showed me some shortcuts. Ah, uh, you got a boost real late there. 
I can't go that way. Come on, boost, boost, boost. Wait, that counts as a finish. Interesting. Imagine if I would have won that, <laughs> won the race because I shot myself across the map. Okay, so just crash into a billboard, which should be easy. Bail out into a billboard, was it? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Smash through a billboard, bail out into a water tower. That's what I'm looking for. Okay. Where is said water tower? I don't know, but I definitely effed up that one. I kind of just wanted to see how far I could go. I think I'll switch characters as well after this, because I think Dave has had enough screen time. He also got to win the race too, which I think should be pretty easy if I tried. Boost, boost, boost. Ah. Too bloody long for the boost to come back. Oh, eat up. Good thing you don't like lose your boost after you fall, because that would be really annoying. Let me know if you guys see a water tower, because I do not see it. Send myself. That way is definitely the best way to get to the finish here. Okay. Well, won the race. I still don't know what water is. Rooftop in challenge mode. Unlocked. Once we find the water tower, it should be easy enough. Whoops. I thought maybe I could, like, boost off and uh, hit the billboard. Obviously, I was mistaken. Jeez. Sorry, Dave. You're just going to die soon, by the way. I don't know how you haven't died yet. Just going to hold on to my boost for now. I kind of want to scope out the place. No one went for this billboard. Hmm. Must be on a roof somewhere. That jump, though. That was sick. Action. Right, boys. It's time to go for that last objective. Get that lovely water tower that was really hard to find. Oh, I made that jump. Sick. I'm like super ahead now, especially because I'm going the wrong way. So the water tower is at one of the last jumps. I'll show you where it is first and then uh, if I miss it, then I'll have to redo it again. But I'll just show you uh, the good attempt instead of watching the course another 10 times. That's probably how long it's going to take me. Just kidding, I'm gonna get it first try here. We're close. Oh, let's get a good angle at this. There she blows. Easy peasy. 
Okay, so that one was pretty interesting. I wish the course was longer. That's what I mean, like if it had its own game and they were like multiple courses, they were longer. Some of these uh, races would be actually really fun. Jackass, the race game. Wii Tattoo. There's always a Wii Man one. Looks like Steve-O's giving Wii Man a nice tat. It's like the brand or whatever that one was called in Jackass 2. Okay, he's on like a little car. Okay, get 800 points. Change ink. It's really hard to control. And it's gonna look awesome. <laughs> Obviously getting in the lines is what you want. Get on the line, bro. There you go. How, how did I get a score already? This one's so easy. What the F? I'm trying to color stuff. We best tattoo ever. <laughs> yeah, all the Wii Man games are very, very strange and easy. I was kind of just goofing off at the end there because I realized how fucking easy it was. Barely did two of the eyes and it was like done. Brown water rafting. Does not sound into Oh my god, there's a guy taking dumps into the river? Nah, man, nah. I'm gonna switch characters too. I'm just gonna skip the cutscene here and then we'll watch it after. Because it's gonna replay it. Dimitri. You don't look like Dimitri. Peachtree TV. Okay, there's going to be multiple ways. Some objects. This looks gnarly. It's an F. Hi, I'm Chris Pontius, and this is Brownwater Rafting. Finish before the raft deflates. Collect 10 floaters. Finish without the raft. Successfully navigate two shortcuts. Navigate into gator room without being bitten. Okay, so this is going to take a couple tries. I wonder what's uh, a shortcut or not. Do I want to go fast? Do I want to go slow? I never know. I'm trying to turn this, Bessie. We're going real fast. wonder where the alligator room is. That's definitely a shortcut. Whatever. Are these the floaties I'm trying to pick up? Just, quest just a question. Alligator room. Let me out. Just gotta test the brown water. You lose air every time you bump into something. It just really sucks. Oh, I'd be trying, boys. I'd be trying.
Whew. All right, guys, here we go. Time to do some brown water rafting. It's very hard to control this, so bear with me as I bump into multiple things. Let's just try to go for the shortcuts and... Uh, ah, that one's really hard because it's can't properly turn yourself. Go in the alligator room again. No! I definitely went right into that gator. Kind of have to alternate to get like a, a nice flow. There's 10 floats at least. Floaties. Floaters, whatever they called it. I'm kind of questioning myself who's Dimitri now, because I don't remember him. I thought it was the dude that played all the suits and stuff, but definitely doesn't look like him. Alright, there you go. There's two down. Finish without a raft. Should be easily. The shortcuts. Navigate the alligator room. Okay. At least we got two of them down. Pressure's off. Wait, why is he bringing me that way? Goddamn poo current. I know they didn't say uh, poo water, but it's brown water, which is pretty darn similar. I'm not a scientist or anything, but. Okay, right, 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 right. Yeah. You know, left, left brother, left brother, no. Well, well, I guess I can continue. No, I'm getting wrecked by crocodiles, <laughs> gators, crocodiles, alligators. So goddamn similar, but I know they're not. So don't get angry at me in the comments, cause. I'm not like a uh, crocodile Dundee or anything. Alligator Dundee. Ow, ow. Alright, this is where the first shortcut is. Just gotta hit the right like crazy. There you go. The next one's left. Just be wary of that. There you go. Can I gain some speed? Two shortcuts. Now, stop bumping into everything. Just want to finish without a raft, and then the last one should shouldn't be too too hard. I think it is kind of really hard to steer. All right, we're getting ready for it. Get ready for the bailout now. This would be a fun in like a little race kind of style as well. Alligator room complete. That one was actually very difficult, but then right there I made it seem so easy. But I swear it took me like no joke, 20 attempts. I guess I can just exit stunt now, can I? Or do I? Let's just bail out just to make sure that it fully goes through. I don't want to exit the stunt and then see that uh, it didn't count. Go for a little poo swim. Okay, there we go. Yeah. <clears throat> What's next, you might ask? Good question. Because I forget. 
shoot Johnny. So I wonder if we actually have to hit him. I'm assuming we do. Shoot Johnny. <laughs> Chris, you're you're a goober. Get fourteen successful hits. Am I going for the crotch? Wish sensitivity was a little bit better. Dome shot. Leg shot. Domer. Did I not get him? It's like a shotgun paintball gun. Ooh. Ooh. Look how close I am getting every time. How much do I gotta get again? That many, I guess. Yeah, that was pretty fun. Can I aim for Chris? <laughs> Came for that booty. There you go, bud. Oddly shaped men. Some more extras and stuff. Awesome. It's what we want. Obviously, you want to get every challenge done to get all the unlockables. Fridge racer. Hell yeah. We're all on a fridge going down a hill. Jeez. Someone like gets rammed by one of these fridge bridges. Fridges? They're gonna take some serious damage. I questioned fridges because it sounds weird to me. Goddamn English. Do some 50-50 on some of the tree branches, or what? Nice course. Looks pretty long. Yeah, that would freaking kill. <laughs> you, you get... You get Steve-o? Win the race, wipe out a jackass, destroy one RV antenna, bail out a hundred yards, destroy six directional signs. Let's go. Accelerate, steer. Damn, you take some serious damage when you run into shit. Ooh, that guy just went, like, right over me. Kind of just going for the win the race because that's the, generally the easiest one. There's a lot of directional signs. Also looking for a nice big hill to launch myself off of. Because 100 yards is... That's pretty far. Okay. Reminds me of SSX Tricky, one of the best snowboarding games. Yeah, definitely bail off there. Those were the R RVs were as well. You don't be with me, pal. Woo! Okay, restart. Okay, we'll go for some directional areas. Oh my, that just got wrecked there. Jeez. Oh, they took them down. Rude. How am I supposed to take them down if you guys take them down? Let's restart this. Oh, well I knocked off a jackass at least. 
three signs. I am surrounded by idiots. There's quite a bit of signs, so I guess I didn't really have to worry about it last time. Alright, antenna and bail. Let's go for the antenna. And if it looks bad, then just bail off. I don't know which way I'm going. It looked like I can go up that hill. So I was trying to. Let's go this way again. It seemed peaceful enough. This might be the only way with the jump as well. Ah, looking bad. Ah, 70 yards. Hit a restart button on that one. Okay. Shouldn't be too hard. Wish you can do the punch ability. That'd be fun. Again, another uh, good race that you can put into this jackass race game that I'm 100% promoting. I'm going to come out with one day. I should contact them by email and be like, Guys, you have a gold mine of racing games in this old 2007 game. You got to come back to it. Doesn't even have to be a jackass based game, honestly. It's just a fun racing game with stupid shit like this. Different objects, pogo sticks, bumper cars, fridges, giant snowballs, stuff like that. Yeah, same thing. I should have launched myself sooner. It's really hard to go for those antennas. Alright, here comes the jump soon. Getting ourselves ready. Let's go. He's pumped. Launch. Daddy. Yeah, there you go. At least we launched ourselves good enough. Holy, you see how many unlockables I got there? I believe I can fly. There you go. Took me a couple attempts, but we got her done. Oh, look how much damage I took there. Woo! There you have it. Episode 6 in the bag. Was it actually challenging compared to the last couple? Well, a few of them, I guess, were challenging. That one was took me a couple tries in that first one we did. Uh, roof race was... Actually, not that hard. Just finding where that water t tower was. Brown, brown water rafting was kind of tricky to get through the alligator area. They all have been super unique, though. I love every single one of the stunts. Let me know what your favorite of this episode was. But for now, I'm going to end the episode here. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. And comment. Check out the description if you want to see the full playlist of Jackass the Game. We'll see you guys on the next episode. See ya.